This week's High School Spotlight features a senior from Roosevelt High who's taken on the challenge of not just one sport but two at the same time. Fox 12's Nick Krepke was in St. John's to kick it with Owen Nathan on the night he set the school's all-time goal-scoring record. Shooter shoot and kickers kick. A few friends told me to just come kick a few footballs for the coach and the team was in need of a kicker, so I just said, screw it, I'm going to have some fun with it. Number one, Owen Nathan. Roosevelt High multi-sport star Owen Nathan is embracing the daily double this fall of senior year. I'm lucky enough to have my first period free at school. So I don't have to go until about 10 o'clock a.m. and then I don't really get home until about 10.30, though, because football practice is right after school, and I just stay and go to soccer right after that. It's around the clock football to football this time of year, as Nathan is captain of the Rough Riders varsity soccer team and the school's all-time king in career goals. I just take a lot of pride in being, like, not necessarily the face, but, like, a leader of of St. John's and a leader of Roosevelt. And this is season two for Owen as kicker under the Friday night lights, where there are no yellow cards for the Velts. He's felt that. First game of the season, I got boomed. <laughs> it was just a bad situation in general. I dropped the ball, and then I went to kick it, and next thing I know, I'm on the ground. Owen is above the rim of the winter as a six-foot-two combo guard and the reigning PIL Defender of the Year. With the Riders' quest for a first state title in hoops in 75 years made it all the way to the 6A state final. That was something I've never experienced before. I mean, like my freshman year, coming off of COVID, so there was restrictions on people coming to the games. Sophomore year, we weren't the greatest team, but last year, our community support was unmatched. Every single game, it was sold out, especially when we, went, when we made it to the Child Center. I mean, there, there was 5,000 people there just booming, and it was surreal. Tack on track events in the spring, and you'd think Nathan may relax in the classroom. Not true. 3.9 GPA proves that with college on the agenda. I'm thinking like a biology route, something down that line, or with animals and stuff. It's just like always interested me since I was little, just like watching National Geographic, stuff like that. No matter where Nathan plays basketball next, North Portland will always be his home base. I personally really enjoyed it just growing up in more of like a diverse area. I think it's really like opened my eyes to more than just like people that look like me. And I, I think that's, that's really like enhanced my experiences for everything, not just sports, but life in general. The good, the bad, and the sometimes harsh realities of growing up. Throw your eyes on me. One, two, three, growing up in North Portland, you make a lot of connections, and you know sometimes there's a lot of gun violence over here, and I've lost a few people to gun violence that that have been tough to me. But besides that, I mean, I've always had a great community around me. So anytime that I'm down, they they can pick me up. Here they are at Roosevelt High, where Owen and the Rough Riders look to double down PIL champs in football and in soccer this fall, then roll back into the basketball season and head back to state, and hopefully for him, secure a scholarship in college. With our high school spotlight at Roosevelt High, Nick Krupke, Fox of Oregon. Man, he can do it all. Now, if you'd like to nominate a student athlete in any sport who's deserving of some time in our high school spotlight, just send Nick a note and then tune in to watch with us on Friday mornings on Good Day Oregon.